Well, each Wednesday this summer, we've been introducing you to musicians from the Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra, since we can't be attending the concerts on the square this COVID year. Today, something a little different. We'll meet one of the people whose generous donation has made the Chamber Orchestra so successful. Here's Maestro Andrew Sewell. This afternoon, we're going to hear from the Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra's performance last December on December the 27th in honor of John and Sandy Lee's 50th wedding anniversary. John and Sandy are a wonderful couple, philanthropic couple that uh, look after many things in town. Their special interest is in the engineering school, the School of Music, and of course, the Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra. introduce you to John Lee. My name is John Lee. Uh, to give you a little bit of background, I'm a graduate of the University of Wisconsin in Madison. Uh, I have a PhD degree in uh, structural engineering. I'm passionate about engineering, obviously, and at the same time, I'm also passionate about music and WCO. I just happen to think that WCO is probably a world-class uh, chamber orchestra in the entire nation. Well, thank you very much. That's high praise indeed, John. And now, let's hear the music. So we're delighted to be able to introduce you this can-can from Orpheus in the Underworld um, from the overture by Offenbach, Jacques Offenbach. Kind of fun to see a concert again. Exactly, <laughs> we miss it this yeah. year. Yeah. And next week we head to Ann Arbor, Michigan, to meet a Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra musician who plays the double bass. And we want to let you know there will be a live concerts on the square next Tuesday. So mark your calendar. The orchestra will be performing in person at Breeze Stevens Field. The theme is Jeans and Classics, featuring the music of the Beatles, U2, and Stevie Wonder. Now the audience will be extremely. Limited. Limited, but you can watch it live at the Duck Pond or online. Go to WCOConcerts.org for more information.